More moms are going under the knife, having plastic surgery. Like it or not, it's on the rise. In fact, a survey from the American Society of Plastic Surgeons shows that if money weren't a factor, 62% of moms would have a mommy makeover. So tonight, in For Your Health, we go inside that fat-sucking breast lift procedure more moms are asking for. Doing under there. On the table is a woman ready to part with her fat. There's the fatty tissue. It's very liquid. Dr. Tim Treese is doing liposuction, part of her mommy makeover. And this is the liposuction cannula. It has three little holes and it will suck the fatty tissue right up through it. So More moms and younger moms are turning to surgery to get their pre-baby body back. Once three and four came along, mostly a lot of loose skin. Don Harris McLean looked in the mirror and saw the effects of giving birth to four boys. Definitely had the muffin top that everybody talks about, a little roll up top. Um, because of the loose skin, you just can't do anything about that. Don knew she was done having children, so she went for it. I had the tummy tuck done and the breast augmentation, and I also had some liposuction around my midsection. And dropped $13,000 for it. Sound extreme? Well, she's not alone. According to the American Society of Plastic Surgeons, women had nearly 112,000 tummy tucks in 2010 and close to 300,000 breast augmentations. All to zap fat and smooth out the baby bumps. Pregnancy changes the body. Abdominal muscles separate and fat shows up where you don't want it. And they hate it. So what we do is a combination of a little bit of liposuction tightening the muscles, and then either a full abdominoplasty for some or a mini tummy tuck for some. Cutting away some loose skin, smoothing the area, and pulling skin tight. And you'll pay anywhere from two to $15,000 for a mommy makeover, but it's not for everybody. One of the most important things is, are you going to have more kids? If you are, your tummy's going to take another hit. Don't do a big tummy restructuring. Expect four to six weeks to heal. This isn't bad at all, is it? No, not. You can see the, the volume's coming down already, so here's her belly button. And for Dawn, she is feeling better in her clothes. I feel really good. I feel um, like I can pretty much wear anything I want. So if you are in the market for a mommy makeover, here's what you need to know. The American Society of Plastic Surgeons recommends waiting at least six months to a year after having your last child. Find a board-certified plastic surgeon and ask to see before and after photos of his or her work. Be specific about your post-baby body goals, and this is important. If you are trying to lose weight, do it before you have any procedure.